This video shares the learning of physics of sports science through video analysis and modeling at River Valley High School in 2010. And this video analysis tool is designed by Professor Douglas Brown. What are some of the best practices learned? To conduct a professional development workshop for the teachers that are going to use this tool, teachers can then conduct the one-hour workshop to get the students to be familiar with the tracker. The teacher communicates clearly the expectations of the learning tasks, the additional tools for self-directed learning. The assignment given can be aligned with authentic learning scenarios such as a sports scientist. Clear communications of assessment rating towards the year-end grade helps students to be motivated. This workshop requires a second teacher, always at the same lab, ready to facilitate improving the social interaction for enhancing the learning experience. Building on students' prior knowledge After the students are familiar with the software, give a challenge, for example, show a new variable called total energy, and give time for students to figure it out. Allow for practice on a new analysis task by practicing video analysis on a different video. What did the students say about this lesson example? Yeah, basically I felt like the lesson was quite like fun because you make use of this, this program right, tracker to transform all the real life things right into like into analysis. Yeah, so that you actually see the actual physics. Yeah, so I realized that part was quite enlightening. Before this lesson, right, I didn't really know like there was this this program. Yeah. And then like um doing like project, right? I think next time like if there's time also, I think I will also like find some videos like this that I want to uh, like investigate, right? To to work, to look at it, lah. Yeah, because I think it's quite interesting. There are a lot of things that you can work on. Jerry, I think this program is quite good because it helps me analyze the the motion of the ball. It's very hard to to do it on paper. I also learned a lot, learned a lot from the program. It will help us a lot during our research. Quite hard to understand because uh, it's our first time using such a program. But I think that you will help us a long way. Uh, nothing we have seen before. Yeah, it was very uh, interactive. Huh? And then the, the visual is much more, uh, it's better for us as learning uh, than all the words on the tutorials. Yeah, it's easier for us to learn. Uh, the system might be a bit hard to use at first, uh, but once you get used to it, it's quite convenient and very fast. It's fantastic. <laughs> yeah, it's really fantastic. Well, why, how, how is it fantastic? It's proved uh, what we have learned during our lessons. Yeah, it's a concept better through uh, plotting this graph from using this software. Uh, uh, normally, I thought those theories, those formulas we learned in our class were not uh, perfectly applied in real life. But this program, is it. it shows us that it it's actually works. Uh, I just think it's something very new and very different. The only obstacle will be just um, to getting used to it. And after that, then um, I think it will be much easier and be more um, be very useful. Very high tech. Very high tech. I think it's very visual, I can see the things clearly. This ends the student feedback. Continuing on the best practice, do provide assessment rubrics. Provide sample assignment report, communicate expectations. Provide online support to make learning accessible 24-7. Blended with face-to-face -face consultation, of course. Do share your ICT in action at ictconnection.edumore.sg